Hey guys, it's Olivia Face here and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I will be reviewing something that's well overdue. Um, I'm probably the last person that's going to review this product, but better late than never. So as you can see, my face is already done and except for the eye area and that is because I will be reviewing the Jacqueline Hill and Morphe palette. Now how I actually got this palette was a complete surprise because I did not order it. Um, as you guys know, I do have a sister here on YouTube. Her name is Bob Bromshell. So she actually ordered the product and she was going away on vacation and I was just like, okay, so since you're going away on vacation, it would be perfect for me to just borrow the palette to um, do a review for my channel. So I went to um, to her house to pick the palette up and I had already seen it on her snap. She had already, you know, opened it, snapped it, as well as I've seen the how it looks like everywhere. So I was just like, when she handed it to me, I didn't even think twice or even looked at it because she handed it to me just like that in um, the original box that it comes in. So I was just like, okay, all right, thanks, whatever. So, um, Later down that night, we went about a day and I was heading home and she said to me, she was like, every time you come over here, you're always getting stuff. So I'm like, you bought me one thing, <laughs> you bought me one thing and you're talking about every time I come over here, I'm always getting stuff. So I was like, in the, the Jacqueline Hill palette, I'm just borrowing it. I'm just going to bring it back anyway. So she was like... <laughs> Who said you're borrowing it? I'm like, what are you talking about? So, long story short is she and she actually ended up buying um, buying me one for myself. So she ordered two, one for herself and one for me. Y'all, my sister is the best. Okay, so that's how I ended up with this palette. So I've already swatched a couple of the colors. I'm really not sure what I'm gonna do on the eyes yet, but see, it's already getting dirty. Um, but when I first, first, first saw this palette, um, when Jacqueline Hill spoke about it, the one thing that drove me to this palette that I fell in love with from the beginning was this shade right here. That blue shade I thought was so beautiful and when I saw it I was just like I have to have that palette. Now my first initial thoughts on it right off the bat is what I don't like about it is the color because I don't know if you can tell I've already gotten you know my there's already like stains on it from me opening the palette um, swatching it and you know the colors just get on the palette so um, apart from that everything else like I said I've already swatched the um, a few of the colors before and um, I have to agree with the fact that how they did the formula in this palette is completely different from any other Morphe, any other, blah, I can't talk, any of the other Morphe palettes because I do own a few and I have to say that this formula and the pigmentation of these colors <coughs> Or out of this world and they're completely different. I don't really have anything um, else to say about the palette. The only thing I said I didn't like was the color of it but it's fine. It's whatever. That's the color that she wanted and she went with so I can rock with that. And some other little facts about it. I believe there are 35 colors in here and it retails for $38. Correct me if I'm wrong. I will put the correct price um, on the screen somewhere here or over here if I got the price incorrect but yeah like I said I didn't order it so I don't know anything of how the shipping works and all that stuff my sister ordered both one for herself and one for me so that's how I ended up with it and yeah everything else there's like a lot of colors in here you guys there's so many colors in here which means you can create so many different looks you have your warm tone your cool shade and you have colors for smoky eye you have colors for pretty much you this this is just an all-around palette for me and I feel like if you're going away and you need like a perfect palette to bring with you I would say this is that palette because it just has so many different shades so many mattes and then shimmer shades and like I said you're warm and your cool tones and it's just perfect so without further ado I am going to start dipping into the palette so as you can see I've already done my face everything else is done except for my eyes I already primed my eyes 
and set my eyes um, with translucent powder. So yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get right into the look of the day. Oh, and one more thing. I know she said that there were names for the colors, but in this packet that I received, there were no, there's no names listed. Um, as you can see, this is just how it is with the little plastic here and there's really nothing on the back to tell you which shade is what so really when I apply them um, yeah I'm not gonna be able to tell you guys what name of what shade I'm using because it doesn't come with the shade and I don't know if um, only the people who receive PR packages get the names of each of the colors which I do think um, I don't really like that I just wish that we all could have gotten the names of the colors. If you're going to name them, then I should be able to know right off the bat by looking at the palette what the name of the shade is and not just a few people if you receive um, a PR package. But yeah, that's it. And like I said, I'm not going to talk anymore. I'm just going to go ahead and head right into the makeup look for the day. So the first color that I'm going to be going in with is these two right here. And as you all know, I love to start off with um, a shade that's similar to my skin tone just to coat or act as a base for my eyeshadow. So I'm just going to go ahead and put these two colors all over the lid. Second shade that I'll be using is this one. And then the pink that you see on my inner corner, I'll be using this shade up here, and the gold on the edge, I'll be using that one. Next I'll be adding a winged liner because what is a cut crease without a winged liner, right? And for the under eyes, I'll be adding this beautiful blue right there. So this is the finished look and for my lips I didn't do anything crazy because I just wanted to focus mainly on the eyes. So for my lips um, I use my NYX Butter Gloss in um, Fortune 50. So that's what I put on my lips and for the eyes as you can see um, I did a pink on top with a little bit of liner from Urban Decay and then I definitely added the blue on the eyes like I said I would because I'm so in love with that blue color. Final thoughts on this palette, I absolutely love it. I definitely don't have anything negative to say. The only thing like I mentioned before that I did not like was um, the color of the palette because um, white I personally feel like it's definitely going to get dirty as my palette have already gotten dirty so as for the um, quality of the shadows itself I definitely think that they are amazing super pigmented and super blendable and just really an all around awesome palette so I would definitely recommend this palette um, whenever she does they do decide to restock because I know they are sold out 
So if you guys haven't gotten your hands on them and you are thinking of buying them whenever they do go back in stock, then I would definitely recommend it. So let me know what you guys think of the look that I created down below in my comment section. And as per usual, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. It's free. It's only going to take a second. So just click on the subscribe button down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.